if you're a high earner, let's say you own your own business, and you kind of heard a little bit something about Irma, you're going to have to pay more for Medicare Part B, but you know, like how bad can it be? It can be bad. It can be like almost $800 extra a month. Now, your insurance at work is typically not as good as Medicare, but when you factor in the the surcharge, the rich tax that you'll have to pay, known as Irma, eh, sometimes it's better to stay on your work insurance. Now, if you own the company, you're really getting sucked. That whole group is costing a lot more because you are the one person that's 65. So that would be a different consideration, in which case you might want to get off of it for the betterment of the company, even though it's going to cost you more. So there's a lot that goes into the determination when you're a high earner. Should you apply? I had a guy today. He said, I don't want to apply for Part D. I don't take any drugs. And I'm going to get hit with the IRMA on the Part D, the drug plan, for 80 bucks a month. And I don't take any drugs, so I'm not going to take it. Everybody's got to make their own decisions here.